tons of videos and you see these comparisons it's like oh okay well here I am it's it's much like okay if I'm gonna try to fly haul with the Hobie 16 I might look at a ton of videos and then I look and then I think I'm gonna look like this when in fact I'm gonna probably look closer to this Think of it as with uh, any sort of equipment, it's the same sort of thing. Once you develop a certain practice or techniques down, then when you compare similar equipment, you're gonna have that same uh, certain flair. When you're new, you don't have that flair. And so these comparisons kind of give you a false sense of hope in a way. And I just want to say this video is a lot more newbie friendly in the sense that I don't have a lot of handheld experience or gimbal experience. So when I go and do this comparison, you're going to see what I think is a bit more realistic to, uh, to something that you might be doing uh, if you're new. With that in mind, here's comparing Canon 50 Zion with a fake Gorilla Pod. Check it out. Okay, in this comparison, I'm looking at walking down some stairs, pulling towards an object, up around an object, and then moving downwards. And all of these, I'm gonna do comparison side by side. It's <clears throat> rather quick. At the end, the conclusion I have may be more contrarian in the sense that, um, well, you'll see. Check it out. these obviously the gimbal works much better okay <laughs> and it's but the thing of it is if you watch other people or if you start using design or uh, you know a grill pod then you're gonna notice that they come in handy in different situations and so my conclusion is if you can use both you're better off because then if you see something you can quickly uh, pick up the grill pod and use it and so the idea is, you know, get good at using both because you're going to find yourself in certain situations or a certain flavor. Um, you can you can get a certain flavor with one over the other, and so it's a matter of okay, what do you what kind of look and feel are you going for? And rather than saying one is better than the other, it's saying you know what kind of situations am I going to be in, and more likely, and probably use that. Like if I'm going to be doing a lot, of, I'm going to be doing a lot of walking or jogging or a lot of uh, active situations, then I'm probably going to want to use that gimbal. But if I'm in a situation where I need to just grab something quickly, uh, you know, tie it up on a tree or uh, get these cool different angles and such that you might not get uh, otherwise, then you're going to want to use a fake gorilla pod. Or so the whole idea isn't one over the other. Just what's your situation and then go from there. If you found this useful, give it a like. Thanks a lot for watching.